In a new study, physicists have shown that surrounding a magnetic source with a magnetic shell can enhance the magnetic field, as it moves away from the source, allowing magnetic energy to be transferred to a distant location through empty space. Note, it is best to read the information provided below more than once, if not several times. It may take a little time to digest and understand the depth of its meaning. As I was writing, I soon realized this will take at least two parts to convey this astounding news and its meaning. Part 1 Science begins to understand fifth world transition new scientific release has me sitting back in my chair babbling words such as, what the? Are you kidding me? Is this for real? In short, the release of this information has me stunned as to their IE science team willingness and ability to go public with their findings. Yes, I'm probably overreacting. But what this data appears to be saying will push the limit of what would normally be outside the bounds of traditional science and open the doors to an established acceptable understanding in the human process of transition. Sure, I have written several articles addressing ancient text and their message of a changing time of which the Hopi and mine specifically use the word transition. I have held a strong conviction of a time of transition. Furthermore, I have gone public telling of what my research identifies as the initiator of a transitional process. It is charged particles coming from our Sunday, our galaxy Milky Way, and various celestial events such as gamma ray bursts and supernovas. Below is what I wrote back in 2005, and have inserted into almost every newsletter since that time. Just as the Sunday solar activity affects the Earth's magnetic field, which has a dramatic effect on Earth's weather that is earthquakes, floods, volcanoes, hurricanes. Consequently, this wave of electrical currents affect the human body's magnetic field. Mitch also reveals a little-known development from modern medicine known as transcranial magnetic stimulation TMS. TMS provides empirical evidence of how magnetic fields can influence human emotions. I believe it will be the magnetic influence produced by the Sunday, which will usher in what is described by our ancient ancestors, as the transition bringing the Earth and us to a new state of being. Mitch Batro's new device provides unprecedented control of magnetic fields new research just released signifies charged particles electromagnetic energy can be captured, concentrated, and directed. This newly discovered technique lies in the transformation of electromagnetic waves which involves metamaterials. Researchers have found a method to control magnetic fields, by designing a magnetic shell with specific electromagnetic properties. In this new study, physicists have shown that surrounding a magnetic source with a magnetic shell can enhance the magnetic field, as it moves away from the source, allowing magnetic energy to be transferred to a distant location through empty space. Metamaterials most metamaterials gain their novel characteristics through the existence of resonances in the component artificial structures. Enabling those materials to manipulate magnetic fields or waves in previously impossible ways. Metamaterial principle is a close cousin to the metamorphosis process, and gives a deeper understanding of metaphysics. These can be oscillations in the electron density or atom density, which occur at some natural, tunable frequency metamorphoses, to change the form or nature of, transform, to undergo or be capable of undergoing a change in form or nature, metaphysics, meta, after or beyond physics, physics, science that deals with matter, energy, motion, and magnetism, modern physics, based on quantum theory, includes atomic, nuclear, particle, and solid state studies metaphysics, the study of universal laws which includes ontology, cosmology, and epistemology. The study of human origin and of human potential which surpasses the physical. Physicists, Carls Navajo, Jordi Pratcamps, and Alvaro Sanchez at the Universidad Autónoma de Barcelona in Spain, have published their results on their new method of magnetic energy distribution and concentration in a recent issue of Physical Review Letters. We have tried with this work to open new ways of shaping magnetic fields in space, since magnetic fields are so crucial for so many technologies e.g., almost 100% of energy generated uses magnetic fields, 
finding these new possibilities may bring benefits. The basis of the technique lies in the transforming fields, that deals with the control of electromagnetic waves and involves metamaterials. While researchers have usually focused on using transformation ideas to control light, here the researchers applied the same ideas, to control magnetic fields by designing a magnetic shell with specific electromagnetic properties. The shell works by dividing the space into an exterior and interior zone and then transferring the magnetic energy completely into one domain or the other. This method differs from the way that superconductors and ferromagnets distribute magnetic energy, where the energy always returns to the domain, where the magnetic sources are. Transcranial magnetic stimulation The magnetic shell could also have medical applications, such as for biosensors, that measure the brain's response in magnetoencephalography, a technique used for mapping brain activity. The physicists also showed that the shells can be used to surround multiple magnetic sources arranged in a circle, allowing them to concentrate magnetic energy in the center of the circle. This arrangement could be used in transcranial magnetic stimulation TMS, a technique used to treat psychiatric disorders. While TMS generally targets regions near the brain surface, the magnetic shells could help extend the reach of magnetic fields to deeper targets.